The reason that you're not going viral on Facebook Reels right now is simply because of the content you're creating, the topic of the content you're choosing, the first three seconds of your video, and how you're recording it, and two other mistakes that I'm gonna share with you towards the end of this video. But I promise you, if you fix all five of these things, well then guess what's gonna happen? You're gonna have your first viral post on Facebook Reels, and if you've already had that, you're gonna be able to go viral consistently. I just hope this creator make these changes, and they've literally gained almost 500,000 followers on Facebook Reels, and it's simply because they implemented the things I'm about to share with you in this video. Tip number one is you need to actually be choosing the topic of your content correctly because at the end of the day, all Facebook's trying to do is push out content to people that have watched content that was similar to that piece of content that you're about to create. So guess what you need to do now? You need to go into not just the Facebook app, but you need to go into the Reels feed and then do a search for something. For example, if you do a search for credit repair, guess who shows up? The creator that I just showed you. Why does he show up? Because he was able to take the topics that other people were doing and do it better and that's why he was able to rank for that. Now he gets a ton of views just from that but also the topics that he talks about now just get more views in general because the first time you go viral for something well then guess what happens it makes it easier and easier and easier to go viral again because the first thing Facebook's gonna do is show that content to people that have seen your past videos and the second thing that they're gonna do is show that piece of content to other people that have watched content similar to that and this is exactly how you get that viral mechanism going on Facebook reels but just choosing the right topic isn't enough. The second thing that you need to do is make sure that the first three seconds of your video are on point. People on Facebook want to be sucked in immediately. And what we call this is the hook of the video. So you need to make sure that the hook of the video does three things. One, you need to have text on the screen or some type of voiceover that is grabbing somebody's attention. Two, you need to be leveraging authority or talking about something that people really care about. If you're not talking about a subject or somebody that people really care about, well then guess what's going to happen? Nobody's going to end up watching the video because you don't actually suck them in. And the third thing is there needs to be something on the screen that makes people's brains go what is going to happen next if those three things don't happen people aren't going to watch your video and if they're not watching your video you're not getting the completion rate that you need in order to go viral on Facebook reels now there is one other tip that I'm about to share with you and then two mistakes that I see so many creators doing on Facebook Reels right now and it's one of the reasons that you're not getting pushed out but before we dive into that I do need to emphasize it is easier to grow on Facebook right now than it ever has been before. In fact I think Facebook has more organic reach than TikTok, YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels and everything else combined and no I'm not saying that those apps are impossible to grow on. I'm not saying that those apps are impossible to get views on. I'm just saying that if you're serious about building a brand or a personal brand right now you need to be uploading on Facebook. Facebook Reels. The reason being, the people on Facebook have a discretionary income. They have money that they cannot wait to spend. And if you give them a reason to spend it, either through sponsorship deals or through selling your own product, well then guess what's going to happen? You're going to make a ton of money if you implement the next three things that I'm about to share with you. And that last tip is actually creating the right type of content. One piece of content that Facebook is going nuts with right now is remixes. I strongly suggest you begin implementing remixes into your content and stitches into your content because if you're doing those two things, you're gonna be able to hook somebody immediately and you should only do a remix and you should only do a stitch of a video that's already gone viral. Why? Because it passes the two other tests that I just shared with you and then guess what ends up happening? You're able to leverage that, stand on the shoulder of giants and ultimately end up getting more views for it if you can add something complimentary to the original video. Okay, so now that we got the must do's out of the way, we need to get into the things that you need to make sure that you're avoiding. The first thing that you need to make sure you're avoiding, and I've seen creators make this mistake literally for years now, not only on Facebook, but on YouTube and on Instagram and on TikTok, and it's one of the worst things that you could do. All of these platforms, they only wanna push content associated with their platform. So if you have a watermark on your piece of content because you're reposting the content from somewhere else, you just created a watermark on it to put it on there yourself, or you downloaded the video from TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, and now you wanna upload it on the Facebook, please make sure you remove the watermark. There's so many AI tools in order to do this. You could just search for how to remove TikTok watermark, how to remove shorts watermark, how to remove Instagram watermark, how to remove any watermark, and it will tell you how you could do it. You simply upload the link to the video, it'll spit out a new file, now you don't have a watermark, and now you can upload that to Facebook and actually get a good amount of organic reach. If you don't do this, they will limit the amount of reach that you get. And in a lot of cases, it might mean that you still get 50,000 views, but you could have gotten 500,000 views. So don't be an idiot and please, do not make this mistake. And the second mistake that I see so many of you make, you're not writing a long enough description. There's no keywords in your description. And what that ultimately leads to is Facebook having no idea who they should be pushing your content to. So please make sure you're making that adjustment. Now, if you wanna get guaranteed followers and guaranteed more reach right now on Facebook, well then keep watching this video because I've got a special offer for you. 
The opportunity to grow on Facebook and this organic reach that we're currently seeing right now isn't going to last forever and there are two things holding you back right now from taking advantage of it. The first one is you haven't yet implemented the things that I just shared with you in this video and the second is that you haven't gotten into my Facebook mentorship program where I literally guarantee that I can help you grow faster on Facebook in the next 30 days or you get your money back, zero questions asked. In fact, the average person that's gone through this program in the last 30 days has gained on average 15,000 followers in just 30 days, which has allowed them to get monetized on Facebook. On top of that, the lowest amount of followers anybody has ever gained that has gone through the program and listened to everything that I told them to do is 1,500 followers. If you want results like that, then go to the link in the description of this video right now and sign up because these results aren't going to last forever and you need to make sure that you're taking advantage of the organic reach that we're currently seeing on Facebook. The way that it's going to work, I'm going to send you a personalized plan that's going to tell you everything that you need to do and I'm going to check in with you every Monday, every Wednesday, every Friday to guarantee that you get more growth on Facebook. I'm going to be telling you what to post, when to post, what hashtags to use. We're going to look at your analytics and critique your content ultimately to guarantee that you grow on Facebook. This is the same exact program that this creator just used to gain almost 500,000 followers and this creator almost 45,000 followers and I want you to be my next success story but I will warn you there are limited spots available so please if you're ready to get into this and you're ready to take advantage of Facebook because you missed out on TikTok, you missed out on Twitter, you missed out on Instagram, and you know that you cannot miss out on this one next. If you want to grow your personal brand or your brand, then go to the link in the description below and sign up right now. I can't wait for you to be my next success story. Or if not, please check out the next two videos I put up on the screen because they're the videos YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.